Well, hello, thank you for joining me today again on the Church History Trail. And we're continuing here in Cumber. And what we're going to do now is we're going to look at the memorial um, for the gentleman who actually designed the Titanic and also perished uh, on the Titanic that fateful day. And who we've got here again is Desi. How are you doing, Desi? How are you doing? And Desi's going to tell us a wee bit about this monument here then. So what have we got here, Desi? Right. What we have here is a, a plinth that was erected in 2012 uh, to mark the centenary of the sinking of the Titanic. And, of course, the Titanic was uh, designed by Thomas Andrews from Cumber. And uh, his name is on the the monument uh, it's in his memory as well as those people who actually worked on the construction of the ship and there would have been people from Cumber who would have worked up in the shipyard um, the, the memorial itself is actually in the form of the bow of a ship oh, you can see that there does I yes now, is this the White Star Line This is the model? White Star Line uh, insignia. Yes. Fantastic. And what does it say here in this desert? Well, it says, erected by Ardsborough Council to mark the 100th anniversary of the loss of RMS Titanic and to commemorate Thomas Andrews of Cumber and his dates 1873 to 1912 who oversaw the plans for the design of the ship and to remember those who worked on the uh, construction. construction and to honour all those who died. It's fantastic, the Desi, isn't it? of April 2012. Brilliant that we'll have a wee, and we're going up to have a wee look at where this gentleman is buried, is that right? Well, not where he's buried. Oh, well, not where he's buried, buried, but the monument. There, there's a monument that marks his. And, I mean, what what you also have, of course, in Cumber is the Andrews Memorial Hall. Yes. Which is a, a big memorial to Thomas and said to be the biggest memorial in Ireland to any one person. Fantastic, fantastic. And then what do we have over here? You're, you're going to show us something over here, Desi, you said? Yes, I'm going to show you a, a memorial that was uh, put here in 2018 to mark the centenary of the death of uh, Cumber's only VC winner. Oh yes, I see that. Edmund de Wynne. Very good. He was killed in 1918 at a place called the Racecourse Redoubt in Grugy in France. It's in Picardy. And it says, although twice wounded and practically single-handed, Edmund defended this important position for seven hours until help arrived. That is brilliant. For this action, he was posthumously awarded the Victoria Cross. And you can see a thing of the Victoria Cross there. That's right. That's brilliant. a design of it on top of the memorial. That's great. Now, there, is there a memorial here too? I think there's another memorial, a recent memorial in 2012 to a to a soldier who lost their life. Charming day. Yes, where's that one? Could you show us that one? Just show you it. Because I, earlier I recorded a wee memorial to this soldier up in the uh, Presbyterian Church. Yes. So is that it there then? Well, this is in the memory of all those in, of uh, Her Majesty's forces who made the supreme sacrifice since World War II. Now, at present, there's only the one name on it. Yes, that's why uh, there. Hopefully there won't be any more on it. Yes. Uh, Corporal Channing Day, who lost her life in Afghanistan in 2012. And she was a medic, wasn't she? She was a medic. That's right. Excellent. Well, now, I have to ask you, because, I mean, that's the biggest monument there is here in Cumber. Who's this gentleman here in this? Hello. That's 
Sir Robert Rowling Gillespie. Cumber's famous general. Uh huh. Uh, born in the square here in 1766. So he was actually born in the square here, was he? He was. My and goodness. The, the house where he was born has been knocked down. Yes. But the same. That the workmen, whenever they knocked it down, they discovered a hoard of gold and that they never worked again afterwards. <laughs> My goodness. It wasn't at the end of a rainbow, was it? <laughs> well, it could have been a rainbow. I just don't know. That's fantastic. Well, again, Desi, thanks very much for your wealth of information. And uh, I've certainly enjoyed uh, the, the history tour that you've given me today. And again, if you enjoy the channel, then please like and subscribe. God bless.